Hey everyone, happy Wednesday. I have such a beautiful scenery in front of me right now. Let me flip the camera around. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but there's ducks over here. It's not really in focus. But um, I don't know, I just love nature and it is so beautiful to me and I love like just everything God has created, right? I mean, it's just so beautiful. So anyway, um, I did a clip of this for my, you know, what, a, what did I eat today or whatever, but I made a smoothie this morning and I'm not going to get it out because you can't even really see it in the tumbler that it's in, but it's uh, three bananas, a bag of frozen pineapple, and like two heaping tablespoons of vitamin mineral green and a little bit of water. And it's going to be really good. I had a little bit of it this morning because there was an overflow of the amount that would have fit in the tumbler. So I drank that. Um, but I don't know. I just, I didn't have time this morning to crack open a coconut and scrape the meat out and do the coconut water thing. Cause I forgot to do it in the morning and I don't ever forget anything. So I was like, what? <laughs> um, so I was like, okay, I'm just going to make a smoothie. So smoothies are always like a backup thing, right? You know, or they're the, if they're the first thing you want to do, that's wonderful. Um, but I really suggest, you know, trying to get the greens in your smoothies, trying to get the minerals, because if you just do fruit, chances are the fruit is not from good soil. So you got to, you know, use the options that we have in this day and age. And that's stuff like vitamin mineral greens, spirulina, chlorella, shilajee, wheatgrass juice powder, um, uh, what's it called uh, from Dr. Morse his oh superfood blend superfood blend that's a wonderful one too and yeah so we got to use these things that you know we've been given maybe a hundred two hundred years ago we wouldn't need the vitamin mineral grain and such because the soil was just so rich but now it's void so we gotta we gotta take advantage of those things so I do and um, I just really enjoy it but yeah, I hope that you guys have a great day today. I am so excited because this is my first day of ingesting bottled water from a glass container. And I'm so excited. Let me pop this baby open. This is Mountain Valley Spring Water. And I think I figured out that this is just a local thing. So I this is, comes from Arkansas. <clears throat> and I live in Oklahoma. So doubtful that you guys can get this especially people that like live in London like Tony the um, boxer and stuff like that so I don't know but but try to find a bottle of water that comes in glass because I don't know I'm just really really into it I don't want the hormones and the plastic and all that yuckiness and today was also the first morning that I washed my hair with my um, shower filter and the water feels different and my hair feels softer. Maybe it's all in my head, but my hair feels super soft today. So I'm going to credit the shower filter. I mean, when you're taking the chlorine out, you're doing a lot of good things. And I've been compiling research on the benefits of shower filters and all the crazy stuff that you can get from the chlorine and the chloramine and all of that. And I'm going to do <clears throat> a video on that this week, most likely. And I have all these videos planned and I'm so excited. So, yes, tell me what you guys are thinking about raw foods. How are you guys doing on your journey? Um, what's your favorite thing to eat right now? What's your favorite um, raw food dish? Mine, you know, I've always said it's coleslaw, but lately I'm kind of sick of it. And I don't really have a favorite dish right now. Can you believe it? I really love bananas and carob powder. That's super good. It's like the carob powder has helped me replace dates. It gives you that kind of chocolatey, milky flavor that I'm not getting from the dates anymore. So I've really been enjoying that. But um, yeah, what is your guys' favorite dish right now in terms of raw food or, or vegan food? I mean, let people know what's, you know, even if it's cooked vegan. So yeah, I hope that you guys have a fabulous Wednesday. And yes, I'm staring at the ducks right now and I just love them so much. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you later. Bye.